hi guys welcome back to ilm academy and in this uh, video we are doing exercise 1b from question 6 to the question 12 okay guys let's start from question 7 so question 7 is hexagon needs to pack 171 pens 63 pencil and 27 razors into identical gift bags so that each item is equally distributed find the largest number uh, of gift bags that can that can be picked so the largest numbers mean HCF so we uh, find the HCF of these three numbers like this the HCF is 9 then on the second part it said that the number of each item in a gift bag means uh, we have to uh, equally uh, fit these numbers into a uh, gift bag so we have to uh, divide every uh, of these pen pencil and uh, razors with 9 that we got from HCF so we divide 171 from 9 then 6 from 9 and then oh sorry 63 from 9 and then 27 from 9 to get answer these are the answers of second part so guys then there is the next question uh, question 8. Question 8 is two car, two race cars, cars X and car Y are standing at point of 2 km track at the same time. Car X and car Y make one lap every 60 seconds and every 80 seconds respectively. How long in seconds it will take both cars to be back at the starting point at the same time? So how long means the LCM? So we will take the LCM of 60 seconds and 80 seconds which is 240. So then there is a second part of question 8 how long in minutes it will take for the car for the faster car to be lap 5 laps ahead of a slower car so uh, we will multiply 5 into 240 seconds uh, then we got uh, 1200 seconds so the answer is 20 minutes uh, it will take 20 minutes for the faster car to be 5 laps ahead of the slower car then guys come to question 9 in which uh, we have to explain whether uh, it is true or false so this a statement is if 6 is the factor of a number uh, then 2 and 3 are also its factor it's true because 6 2 and 3 are also the whole numbers so uh, that's why uh, it is true and then come to the b part if 2 and 3 are the factors of a number then 6 is also a factor of that number B part is also true because it is the opposite of A part so basically okay. it's true then if 2 and 4 are the factors of a number then 8 is also a factor of number uh, it's uh, false uh, because uh, 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 2 and 4 make the uh, odd number and 8 is also so that's why uh, this will not uh, factorize equally upon the number so uh, in D part uh, it is if the if f is a factor of n then n over f is also the factor of n it's also true and the uh, e part is if h is the hcf of p and q then p and q are divisible by h so it's also true so guys here's question 10 uh, in which we have to find the lcm of 9 12 and n uh, is uh, 252 uh, if n is odd find the all possible values of n so first we take the factors of 9 12 and 252 uh, these are the factors and we have to choose the largest one from these the largest one from these is uh, first is 3 square into 7 so we take the po these are the possible values of n 3 square into 7 is equals to 63 now guys come to question 11 the first statement of question 11 is uh, if 6 is a multiple of a number then 12 is also a multiple of number whether that it is true or not so it's true because uh, there every number that 12 has is divisible by 6 so that's why it's true but uh, with the b part is if 12 is a multiple of a number 6 is al also the <coughs> it's not because uh, the 12 had the numbers which are not divisible by the numbers which is on the table of 6 that's why c part is also true if 18 is a multiple of a number then 18 is divisible by that number okay so 
it's obvious that the number which is multiple also divisible by this number so then uh, there is comes the d part it's also true if m is the lcm of p and q then m is divisible by p and q lcm is taken only when it is divisible by any number so guys now come to question 12 so question 12 12 is kate wishes to cut some squares from uh, wenger sheet with a length of 64 centimeter and breadth of 48 centimeter and she likes the square to be as big as possible and she does not want any leftover vanguard sheet so part one is what is the length of each square so uh, to take length we have to take the hcf of 64 centimeter and 48 centimeter so the lc hcf is uh, 2 raised power 4 is equal to 16 so length of uh, each square is 16 second part of question 12 she said that how many squares can cut can she cut together so uh, the answer we got 16 from hcf we will divide on both lengths so we will divide this by 64 and also 48 so the answer will be multiplied together and it is equals to 12 